of the Iron Body 700 workout plan. I'm really excited to show you this workout. We're going to be doing three different exercises. Hip dips, which really target your love handles. Now again, you can't spot reduce, which means just eliminate the fat off of one part of your body. Uh, you have to reduce your total body fat to reduce a particular area. But I will say this, is that when you're doing an exercise for a specific body part, you can strengthen and tone that area, which is going to um, bring out the muscular definition. So you want to target from both areas, or from both aspects. You want to look at the spot reduction and you want to look at uh, working it from a strengthening standpoint. But I'm really excited about this one, this workout, because we're going to be doing love, uh, love handle workout, which are hip dips. I'll show you that one real quick. And then we're going to be doing uh, what I call walking push-ups, which strengthens the entire chest, shoulder girdle, upper back, etc. And we're going to be doing a... Uh, a replacement for chin up if you don't have a chin up bar or pull up bar and I'm going to show you that real quick I set this up this is what I have I've got two chairs and I put my weights against the body weight channel and I'm not using these weights to exercise with I'm using it to stabilize and this I have here is just a regular garden hoe I mean it's pretty sturdy and you may think oh I don't have a chin up bar I don't have a pull up bar how do I work my upper back, how do I work my biceps using body weight exercises. It just takes a little bit of creativity and I just have two chairs here that I found around the house and I have a little groove up top and so you may have chairs that either have a groove up at top or maybe a flat top or they may have a second rung where you could stick some type of pipe or hoe or whatever you could find in that rung. And so when you come at it from here, you can do your different push-ups. You can do your normal pull-ups. Sorry, I said push-ups, pull-ups. You can do your chin-ups. You could do a special, what I call, hanging monk, which you're going to be doing in a little bit. You could do your one-arm one -arm, pull-ups. You could do a lot of different things. So we're going to be incorporating that into our workout plan for today. Hip dips, which is our first exercise. I'm going to show you real quick. You're going to be coming at it from here, stabilizing your body, bumping down, just touching the ground, and then pushing up like that. One, two, just like that. And then when you switch sides, go ahead and switch sides. Up like that. Okay, so for the last one, and this is why I brought this towel for me, is that it's called walking push-ups. And... Again, it's a really unique exercise, body weight exercise, and you're going to be getting in the normal push-up position. Come down, right, left, right, left. That's one. And then when you switch to the other side, left, right, left, right. So walking push-ups. It's kind of like you're walking stationary. Right, left, your, your upper body staying in position. Right, left, left, right, left. So you're alternating. So one full rotation is one. So one, two, three, like that. So you're really going to feel it in your, <coughs> your shoulders, your upper chest, etc. So that's the, those are the three exercises. We're going to be doing 700 total of those today. Start drinking your water because we're going to start warming up. And again, we've got our timer. We're going to be doing one minute in between each 100 reps. So again, 100 reps is a set, and we have seven sets total. And we'll cycle through each exercise until that we reach 100 reps. Then we count that as a set and relax, rest for a minute, and then we continue on until we reach seven sets. So start getting your stretching in. Uh, yeah, again, it's early where I'm at. Oh, stretch. So I gotta wake myself up a little bit. Do some neck circles. One way. Uh, then the other. Bob them back and forth. Just get loosened up. 
shoulders, get the shoulder circular motions, backwards, just a little bit, maybe 10 full ones, then forward, reverse the head circles, all right, I hope you're not too sore, I know that first day I got a lot of responses and emails that it was really difficult and challenging, and so that was a good thing, and this one's going to be pretty challenging too, I really love the pull-ups. Now you don't need to use this type of system. You could use your own pull-up bar if you, if you have it. And but I just wanted to show you some creativity. I actually have one of those P90X bars in the other room. But a lot of people don't have that, and you don't need it. And you can use your own tools that you find around the house to get a great body weight exercise workout in. So let's go ahead and actually get started. Again, if you don't have your workout sheet, download it. I'll put a link down where you could, or a link on the page where you can download it. And then just mark an X each time you finish a set of 100 reps. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys and girls, let's do this. I have a little blanket here for me because I'm a wimp. Just kidding. It's a hard floor, so... I use that for my walking push-ups. All right, you ready? Let's do this. Let's go. Hip dips. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, one, two, three, twenty-four. 25, make sure to try to get up high, like that. You know, just do a small range of motion. Unless you're just starting out, then you don't need to move too high. All right, so we're at 25. Let's go, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 22, 33, 35. Keep going, 36, 38, trying to match it. 39, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. Or six, or seven, or nine, fifty. You'll be able to feel it right in your obliques. It's a really good exercise. All right, walking push-ups. We're at fifty. One, two, three, four. Try to keep your back straight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, which I'm at, that means 61. 62, I don't know I was counting like that. 63, 64, dig for it. 65, oh, 66, 67, 68, oh, 69, oh, 70. Okay, no rest. Get underneath your pull up. 70. I have 30 more to go. You could put your feet on a bucket or some books or whatever you want. The higher your feet go, the higher the harder it's gonna be. If you can leave your feet on the ground, it'll be a little bit easier. 70, 30 more. 31, 32, 34, 35. Try to get full range. 36, 39, 80. 81, 82, 83, Whew. rest for two seconds, 84, 5, 86, 87, 80, 89, 90, 91, oh, 92, 93, 94, oh, oh I want to finish up with those, 94, Shake it out a little bit. It's 94. 95. 96. 97. 98. 100. All right. Mark it off. Mark off your set. We are one down. I set the timer. One minute. Drink your water. You can walk around, shake out. You can start to feel it. I 
if you haven't already. But I really like this exercise for these exercises because they target muscle groups that you don't normally think that you can get with just doing body weight exercises. So <clears throat> they walk, they work a lot of stabilizer muscles, the walking push-ups, your shoulders, and you're targeting your shoulders in different unique ways. So when your one arm is down, the other arm is up, you're focusing on different aspects of the shoulder muscle that you don't normally get from maybe just handstand push-ups or normal push-ups. So it's a really good, good tool in your arsenal. All right, let's go. So second set. So we start with hip dips. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa, I'm falling. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I'm switching. You can go further. You don't need to follow me exactly. I did 20. Now switch. And then keep going up. 21. 23. 25. 27. 29. Then try to keep your back straight. By that I mean not coming forward like this. 31. 33. 35. Push up towards the ceiling. 36. You don't need to touch the ground if you want to. Yeah, you can. That'll be a little bit harder. Three, seven, eight, 40. Oh, okay, switching. Okay, switch to walking push ups. Oh, 41. 42. 43. Oh, 44. Slowing down. 45. Keep going though. 46. 47. 48, uh, 49, 50, uh, 51, 52, 53, uh, 54, you just need to tap that top arm, 55, you don't need to put any weight on it, 56, 57, 58, uh, uh, 40 more. 40 more. It's getting sweating already. We're just starting off, baby. Okay, now 60. We have 40. Oh, good old natural pull ups. Like you're hanging from a tree doing them. Oh, okay, 40 more. I'm at 60. Right, let's go. See you on. 63, 64, 65, 67, 69, 70, 2, 73. Oh, hang for a little bit. Saying that for myself too. I'm at 78. All right, let's do this. Or 80. You want to almost cheated? Me too. They try to come up all the way. 84. Some of you may like country, some may like rock, I like classic rock, 
Jimi Hendrix, Stevie Ray Vaughan, uh, Def Leppard, Led Zeppelin, that type of thing. But whatever works. I remember actually reading a study a while ago and they were testing music and its effects on people's workouts and the level of intensity that they can bring. So a while ago, so I don't know exactly what they're measuring, how many variables and everything else. But what they did find, that I do remember, is that actually classical music affected the workouts more effectively than, say, like a heavy metal or a high intensity <coughs> uh, music, which I thought was really interesting. Again, I don't remember the study and I don't know too many too much information about it, but all right, let's do it. Number three. <sighs> okay. One, two, three, four. <sighs> all right. Ten, uh, 11, 12, 13, 15. Uh, gassing. It's like seeing 18, 19, 20. Uh, Again, you should be feeling it right in your sides. You love handles. That's a, that's a good one. Alright, 20. 21. 22. 24. 25. 27. 31. 32. Oh, 35. 39. 40. Okay, switch. Again, don't quit, man. Don't quit. Just push it one after the other. One exercise after the other. Don't even allow yourself to entertain the thought, I can't. It doesn't exist. Okay, 41. 42. 43. 44. 45. 46. 47, 48, 49, keep going, uh, uh, 50, 51, 52, 53, uh, uh, 54, 55, uh, 56, quick little two seconds, uh, uh, Just a quick breather. Collect your your thoughts, your mental faculties. Okay, this is what. Yeah, 40 more. Right, let's do this. Oh, high intensity, baby. Shot of adrenaline. Let's do one. Let's do three. Four. Let's do five. Let's do Seventy-six. What are you at? Make sure you're counting and remembering your number. Uh, uh, Seventy-six. Uh, okay. sides to be even. Oh. 
100. Okay, you guys are doing awesome. Proud of you for sticking through it this long. We just did three full sets. We have four more to go. Whoops, I gotta hit the timer. Might as well be sitting there forever. Get your drink. <coughs> Wipe yourself off. And remember, you can do it. I wrote a blog post a little while ago where I asked a bunch of Navy SEALs how they made it through Hell Week. Hell Week is uh, basically the training proving grounds for BUDS training for Navy SEALs. Really difficult five days where they get four or five hours of sleep total over five day stretch. And they have to do mental training tests and sleep deprivation. They have to do a ton of physical extreme uh, running to push-ups to carrying logs to carrying the rafts to sitting and swimming and through the really cold surf. Basically they're cold, dirty, wet, hungry constantly. And I asked them how they made it through. And a ton of people said that they didn't even entertain the thought, I can't. It just wasn't part of the vocabulary. So we try to develop that mindset. I can't. It doesn't even exist. You said you were going to do it, you do it. Right? Okay, let's do it. Uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, eight. Try to get full range. Nine, ten, eleven, two, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty, I'm gonna do five more, twenty, nineteen, four, twenty-five. Oh, break my old record. Oh yeah, let's do this. Feels good. Just say it feels good. Feels good. Feels good. Oh, five, six, five, seven. Oh my gosh. Falling 28, 28, 30, 50, oh, hey, we're halfway there, we just made the halfway point, all right, let's go. Push it. Growl if you have to. Alright. Let's go. 51. 52. 53. 54. 55. 56. 57. Try to keep your butt parallel. Don't come up too high. Don't start slinking it down. Keep it straight. 58. Nine, push it. Sixty. Oh, keep going. Sixty-one. Oh. Sixty. Uh, uh, two. Uh, come on. Push it. Sixty-three. Oh. Uh, Sixty-four. I know you're tired. Uh, Sixty-five. Oh. your beat. You can do it. If you have a normal chin-up bar and you're like, man, I'm not even getting four or five of them, get a chair and put your feet on a chair. That'll ease it up a little bit and help you stay with us. Or do your four or five and then wait. That's perfectly fine. I'm at 65. What are you at? Remember your number. Okay. Let's go. Seven, eight, nine, seven, two, three, three, four, five, 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 six, seconds. I think I got to 82. Okay, let's do it. Oh. I didn't count. I 
I didn't get up very far. Uh, uh, Mindy, uh, yeah. Okay, finish up. I want to. There's a one hundred. Whoo! What do you guys think? Is this a good one? Hard enough for you? Maybe too easy? Maybe too long? Are the workouts too long? Let me know in the comments section. And when I create the workout next month, I will look at those comments and create a plan that suits the majority. Now again, this is called an extreme body weight exercise channel. So it's gotta be tough. But if you want me to show more modifications to each exercise, different ways of doing a hard exercise to make it a little bit easier, if you're just starting out, let me know and I'll incorporate more of those. <clears throat> Keep stretching. Don't just sit there like me, talking away, talking away. Don't you love this whole idea? I thought of that the other day. I'm like, okay, how are we going to do this? Without using our P90X bar. Where there's a will, there's a way. Okay. That's how many sets we have left. Three. Three more sets. You already did four. You can do anything. Push your push yourself. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four. Nine. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Think small love handles, small love handles. Okay, that was 25 for me. Uh, six, 25, uh, 31, 33, 35, 37, uh, uh, 40. Oh, that's too hard for you. You gotta adjust your hand position a little more difficult. 50. Yeah. Alright, walking push ups. That was 50 for me. Almost done, guys. Oh, let's do it. Yeah. Oh, 51. 52. Make sure you're alternating each side. 53. Left up, left down. Right down. Right up. 54. Right down, left down. Right up, left up, 55. Uh, now all the way. 56. 57. Ah. Uh, 58. Ah. Uh, 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 60. 31. Ah. Uh, 62. Ah. Uh, 33. start to realize that you really need these weights because your body weight will just collapse these chairs into you. Mine aren't that stable. I've got them on the pad and then have the weights on them so it's pretty stable. Not 100% but it's pretty good. So I'm at 65. Uh, 
Oh, I want to keep going. Oh, a couple seconds. 83. Again, make goals to yourself. To yourself. I'm going to do 20. I'm going to do 15. Whatever it may be. That helps push your mind. Your body will want to give up. Your body will want to sit on the couch and eat potato chips. But your body doesn't need that. Your body actually needs the opposite. So you have to push your, bo push your body through your mind. It's your mind that's strong. Jack Lane would will himself. And he'd scream at his body doing, while doing exercising. While exercising and saying, you will obey me. Okay, 83. You will obey me, body. Eight, four, five, six, eight, seven, sweat rag drink your water not too much water just enough take your minute rest man it goes by fast doesn't it now in future workouts I'm gonna incorporate some really intense workout styles like Tabata training where you do 20 seconds uh, just really really intense and then 10 second rest I'm going to be doing incorporating plyometrics into our bodyweight exercise sessions. I'm incorporating a lot of different workout styles because you really want to challenge your body. You don't want to just do it. You're doing the same thing over and over again. And I'm adopting this model off of what Jack Lane would say. He said every 30 days he changes his routine so that his body doesn't have a chance to adapt too much. Our bodies are really efficient, so we need to adapt. Adapt our workout style, style so we are constantly getting those effects. Okay, two more sets. Just push through. You're almost done. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, four, nine, two, three. I love it. I'm at 25. Because it's really working your shoulder. Stabilizing your shoulder, and then you can see obliques. 26, 27, 30. Yeah, that's my all time record. 30. Oh. Tomorrow you'll feel it in a lot of different places. But your shoulders, especially. Oh, okay. I'm at 30. Okay, get in position. Uh, 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 70, 
too. Oh, keep going. That's why they fight for everyone. Oh, 75. Okay. That's good. Oh, 75, yeah. Almost the last set. That should make you happy. That's making me very happy. Okay. Oh, man. Uh, oh, 75. Okay. Yeah. It's a love-hate relationship. I, relationship I have with this whole... 75. Okay. Okay, let's do it. Three, two, one, three, six. sense too and in a good way you know achievement I'm hoping you're hanging this on a place you can see it every day I hit the timer and looking at it and seeing it on the fridge and saying you know what yeah I'm not gonna grab that bowl of ice cream or that slice of pizza that's left over from everyone else eating it the night before I'm gonna make myself this is a really healthy salad or and you don't need to stick to just salads. You can eat a lot of different types of food and still be really healthy. My wife makes incredible meals that are just that aren't just salads, but they're full course meals, but that are using healthy substitutes. She makes pizza. She makes uh, lasagna, spaghetti. I mean, a lot of these meals that you think. I can't have because they're too starchy. Those carbs are bro bro then broken down, stored as, stored as fat, etc. That's not true. You can have incredible meals, which we'll be getting into more on a shot of adrenaline uh, in the future. But exciting news is that this is our last set. Uh, you've, if you made it this far, congratulations. Not many people can make it this far. Not many people are doing their workouts. Very few, in fact. So if you're one of the few that are getting this far and doing your workouts, I applaud you. Okay, let's do this. 100 more reps and you are done. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Give it all you got. 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 30 I'm switching 30 okay gets the heart rate going too doesn't it it's a cardio workout as well cardio and strength training okay let's go there you go you four Seven. Forty. Forty-two. Six. Last 
one, you push it, push it all you got. Okay, there's 60. Alright, let's do this. Okay, 60 on. 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, oh my gosh, 67, 68, Seventy. Thirty more. I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Be proud of yourself. You're almost done. Hitting it hard. All right, let's go. I love. I love. This is our love. Oh. Seventy. I'm at seventy. What are you at? Okay, let's go. Straighten legs. yourself. Your muscles fatigue, your fail, muscles fail, push through it. Oh, I don't know, I think that was two I did extra. 84. 87. Oh, oh I want to do another set. 87. Oh, just give me more. Give me more. 87. What are you at? Almost done. My muscles, you work, you work hard, biceps, you pump. Oh, uh, 91. Okay, I'm switching. Finish up. Two. Four. Seven. 100. Wow, did it. Oh man, mark off your last set of achievement. Oh man, here's some water. Oh, oh, dehydrated. Oh. Begin to stretch out. Oh. You want to get those shoulders? You really work those shoulders. Oh. Just circle your shoulders. Let your body begin to cool down. Congratulations. You just finished day three of the Iron Body Challenge. Iron Body 700 workout plan. What do you think? 700 enough? Is it too much? Did you make it all the way through? Let me know in the comments. Check out that video of that old man, too. He's 60 years old and uh, doing 700 push ups a day. Okay, grab your arm. Stretch it out. You really work the shoulder joint, shoulder capsule, the shoulder girdle. Stretch it out. Oh, relax your head too. Breathe slower. Oh, relax your arm. Relax your head. Breathe deeper and deeper. Oh yeah. Stretch out your back. You're really going to kind of stretch out. Especially doing those love handle, the hip dips. They'll really strengthen your whole midsection. And then if you have low back issues, if your low back is weak, it will strengthen it. But it will uh, tighten it up really good. So uh, you want to stretch it out right afterwards. 
and congratulations that was day three of the of the challenge of the uh, workout tomorrow will be, be day four which is our last day for the week then we'll have three more weeks until we be done with that section so congratulations feel free to email me or put comments underneath the video underneath the post with questions you could ask questions about diet you know, how many percentages of carbs proteins and fats should I be getting to either lose weight or tone up any other questions you have just go ahead and put them in the comment section and I am just really happy to answer them for you so congratulations